Good morning, everyone. I'm using P90, which I do every morning. On I go from level 8 to level 9 to level 10. This energizes my body, gives me sustainable energy all day, focus, clears out trauma in my body and in my meridians, um, creates neuroplasticity in my brain, clears out trauma in my brain, activates all my cells in my body, removes coagulation of the blood, detoxes old cells out of my body. Today I wanted to talk about the matrix. Matrix, if you look it up, means womb. Womb is your body. You have a womb because every time you reach a new level of consciousness, you are reborn. Neo is connected to the reptilian part of the brain, to the matrix. When he wakes up to his higher consciousness, he wakes up to his neocortex, the higher consciousness part of the brain. Symbols have meanings, and the, tri the top of the triangle on the pyramid that is your consciousness. Your consciousness is separate from your body. The consciousness is the light. It's where all of us can find our answers, but you have to look within. Neo is an anagram for one. Neo one. Everything is within you. It's in the consciousness. The Ankh, the Egyptian Ankh, the center of it is a consciousness that breaches out to all humans. We are able to tap into everyone's consciousness and you choose who and what you want to tap into. You are the creator, you are the one, you are Neo. You have the ability, all human beings have the ability that um, animals do not as much is to tap into your consciousness and to choose and to create. And I just want you to be aware that everything you need is inside of you and that's why you have to look within. When you pray, you actually are looking within. You are speaking to your own subconscious. You are speaking to the whole universe and the creation of universe and you are working with the universe one song everything that you want and know is inside of you and all the energies around you are happening all at once so you have the power to create and choose your own thoughts your own your own reality. Just keep practicing, keep flexing the muscle. We did not learn this in school. We're learning it now. We're remembering our member, our body, our heart, our soul, our mind, our spirit. Stay joyful, stay pet present, stay optimistic. Look at all perspectives before choosing the one that is the righteous one, the one that is the best for yourself, as well as you're not hurting, stealing from another. Keep your vibration high by keeping out low vibration entities such as sounds, words, food, music, people, energies, thoughts, Keep your vibration high to keep your cells vibrating high to stay alive and healthy longer by thinking of high vibrational thoughts, listening to high vibrational words, speaking high vibrational words, looking at high vibrational things, watching high vibrational shows, eating high vibrational food, fruits, vegetables, water, Staying away from low, dead frequencies. 
always leading in love. If you are being surrounded by things or people that is low vibration, leave in love. Wish them the best. Don't push people away, but create boundaries for yourself so that they may walk into your power instead of you walking into their power. Your power is always going to be leading the pack when it is high vibration. So you don't have to worry if you leave someone's presence because you have planted a seed within them for them to also rise. Take care of yourself. Be kind to one another. Help others when you can. Even simply looking and giving a nod and a smile is going to change someone's day. Coming back at, at people that have anger with an energy in you that is a healing energy that is natural for you. Okay. We are here to empower one another with boundaries. All right, remember, you can be reborn again by raising your consciousness, which requires you to look within. Love you.